13 News Now begins with breaking news this morning. The Newport News Police Department mourning the loss of one of their own. An officer was killed in the line of duty last night. It all began during a traffic stop on 16th Street. Nearly 12 hours later, the road still shut down. 13 News Now reporter Allie Weatherton is there right now. Allie. Well, Ashley, Dan, this is such a heartbreaking story. If you take a look behind me, you can see police still have this area blocked off. Crime scene tape is here right off of 16th Street, and part of the road is still shut down. Now, police say this incident happened just before 7 last night off of 16th Street. Investigators tell us the officer pulled someone over, and during that interaction, the driver pressed on the gas and took off. Now, the person driving that car dragged the officer before it crashed near 16th Street and Walnut Avenue. Police say the driver of the car is in custody. Medics rushed the female officer to the hospital where she later died. Now, Chief Steve, Steve Drew showed up last night here at Centera Norfolk General Hospital to support the fallen officer's loved ones. Now, right now, both the officer and the suspect have not been identified. Now, Steve, Steve Drew is also having a press conference today earlier um, at 10 o'clock this morning. We will be there and provide you all the details on air and online at 13newsnow.com. Now, all night we've seen signs of support. Madison is in the studio with all of that. Yes, Ali, law enforcement agencies across the Commonwealth have been sending their condolences to the Newport News Police Department. Now, as you can see, many have posted pictures of the shrouded badge. It honors an officer killed in the line of duty. So far, we've seen posts from the FBI, ODU, several local cities and state police, just to name a few. Now, badges typically stay shrouded until a funeral for fallen officers as it's been held. Ashley. All right, Madison, thank you. Well,